Welcome on back and double check our quest log because I don't remember what we're on. All right, we're still about the ancient ruins and we're going to go question Lady Morgan, I guess. So. Let's go question Lady Morgan. I love it how you can just barge into the houses and they're not guarded. Good day, Lady Morant. Do you remember me? Of course. Sir de Sardé, isn't it? I hope that you and your cousin have grown to like it here. But I have little reason to believe you have paid me a visit to exchange civilities. Can I be of service? What can you tell me about New Serene? It's a new city whose construction began not long ago. When I arrived five years ago, there was just a port, a fence, and some huts here. The businesses, the barracks of the guard, the palace, and all of the houses sort of sprung up from the ground. To see how impressive it is today, even if it is still far from its majestic mother, is incredible. Of course, with such expanse, all kinds of bandits, drunkards, and other lowlife have arrived. But I'm very proud of it, in spite of everything. I hope that your cousin continues this work. What do you know about this island? Much less than I would like. The land is still wild and extremely rich. Its soils are full of minerals, some of which are unknown to us. With regard to the flora and fauna, you've probably seen how different the creatures and plants are here. The islanders protect their land fiercely, and we cannot begrudge them that. When you see what we have done with our own, well, such a source of richness attracts greed. You seem interested in the islanders. As a matter of fact, I find their culture fascinating, but I can't say I know much about them. They are quite secretive and protect their cult and traditions from the curiosity of strangers. I know that their sages they call them Donegada, are the guardians of their rituals as well as of the island. They have very strong links with nature and the creatures that inhabit it. They're also good healers. I could talk about them for hours, but you will learn more from the islanders themselves. I'm surprised there wasn't a dialogue from the princess there with her since she's a companion what can you tell me about the relations we have with other nations we play a difficult role caught between these two enemy nations who are nonetheless our allies the smallest action could tip the balance and draw us into their conflict if i may offer some advice be very careful we do not want a war to break out here Too late for that one. What do you know about the ruins found to the northwest of here? <laughs> the site that the natives call Didakidnadagais. That is not how we pronounce it, but yes, we are speaking of the same place. <laughs> your language is difficult to master, but I find it fascinating. Uh, to answer your question. I had countless questions about the place when our explorers and scouts first brought back sketches. Intrigued, I went there. I noted the architecture and their decorations. It is certain that they bear a striking resemblance with continental constructions, but they are more ancient. Too old to have been recently built by the Bridge Alliance settlers when they first set foot on the island. I even questioned the natives, but they only spoke of a people of the sea. My first thoughts went to the Noughts, but they're not known for building large towns, less so cities. 
there are other ruins on a cliff to the east of here. Perhaps they hide the key to this mystery. I hoped to organize an expedition, but the region is dangerous and hard of access. We explored mines at the bottom of the cliff, but we were not able to find an access to the plateau. If the mystery of these ruins intrigues you as much as me, it is in that direction that you should begin to look for answers. Can I help you with any other matter? My lady, I have to go. Goodbye. Well now, that's interesting. And I forgot I had to do some stuff for her. Yeah, well, there we go. So we'll see if we can find this old mine. I don't know why I ran out here. Travel globes in my house. Oh, don't tell me. Okay. So don't tell me it just glitched out because my goons are in the way. Alright, where are we going? Okay. Shore of Tall Bones. Let's see what's here. This is where it always gets me. All of them do. 
Hey, we got more of your supplies in. Wow. Maybe I need to switch to magical damage there for a little bit. Alright, well, hey, at least we can actually make a good amount of ammo now. I'm glad to see that going up. I'm going to see something. This Kurt's with me. He's nice. It says I get a crafting bonus. I want to see some. Just because. Let's see. No, it didn't. It didn't give it to me. I was hoping that it would give me a um Yeah. I was hoping it would give me a level two crafting, but it's not. So it was worth a shot. It really was. It was worth a shot. Lady Morange said the ruins would be around here. She must have been talking about Deidre. Well, let's see what kind of trouble we can find around here. Switch my traps around here. Magic did a lot of damage. Look up there. This is D3, the ruins Lady Morange told us about. But I do not know how to get there. The path collapsed. Some of the tunnels in the mine may lead to it. We should go there. Sure. Right after we murder these things.
Well, at least we're getting a pretty good amount of trade goods. We're starting to get a little bit up there in power. Kind of uh, nice to see. I think that looks like a campsite. That works. I sure there's a way I could get those vines down. Maybe a little bit later. Hey! We have a skill point. Let's see what we can get. We have two skill points. Very nice. All right. Let's take a look at what we can do then. Let's go ahead and get a grenadier going here. Holy crap. Yep, yep, grenadier it is. Okay, yeah, that went very well. I will take that. Something for Vasco. Looks like a caravan. Let's see what's in this mine. See if we can get to this mine. That's right. Run, bird. Run. Huh. There's some up on that ledge. We can't get to it yet. I know it. Oh, maybe we did have to go through these guys.
three of them. That was my mistake. Wow. Yep. Bombs are pretty nice. We go. Very nice. Are doing some adjustments here. Gonna go with set magic trap here. And then we're going to go throw elemental bomb the top. So we'll do that. Just so I can deplete armor quickly. So it looks like we're coming together and the uh, class I should have picked was the technical one because uh, me using firearms and traps, grenades, and really only one-handed weapons, so yeah, should have uh, went ahead and gone with that class from the beginning. <laughs> oh cool, another campsite. I know I missed some goodies. There we go. All right, 
make some more bombs. Right, here we go. That looks like it'll come in useful. We're gonna against bosses. Fifteen. Yeah, we're gonna bump that one up. Yeah, we'll go and bump up some more ammo. There we go. Let's get some preparation in. Let's see. Yep, yeah, that's going to go to Vasco. Base is, okay, his is 24, those are 22, so we'll be wanting to get Kurt new gloves here. So it looks like my work isn't done. Those are expensive. Keep making them, thank you. Oh, he has dragon's blood. Yep. Yes. Yes. Oh, this hurts. Yes. Okay. Thank you. It was a pleasure. Another crafting table. It may be worth talking to the villagers. Okay. We'll need to go ahead and upgrade Kurt's stuff. Right there. Okay. Let's continue on. All right. Good day. What can I do for you? Did you build this village? Not by myself, no. Mm -hmm. We did it. We have to sleep somewhere, you know. We don't have much here, and we'd sure like the place to prosper and grow. 
Maybe more miners will come. Then we'd start to attract all manner of merchants and craftsmen. Do you need anything else? Here, what is your plan to do that? What can you tell me about the ruins on the plateau? You aren't the first to ask me about them, but the answer is still the same. I've nothing to tell you. Not that I wouldn't want to, but I've never been there. There must have been a path once upon a time, but it's no longer there. Maybe it collapsed. Some say that you have to pass through the mines to get there. A few of the tunnels do climb. It's certainly possible, I would say. But those tunnels are all closed. And we have better things to do. The iron ore. It doesn't come out of the ground by itself. Do you need anything else? Talk to me about the mines. It wasn't us that first dug them out. They're really old. Centuries old. But those tunnels are full of riches. It takes little effort to unearth the minerals that we want. What more could we ask for? As seeing as how there aren't that many of us. If we were pressed to mine all the tunnels, we'd be too few. But the time will come when folks hear about what we're pulling from these rocks. We won't be alone for much longer. All right. I gathered from that there's a lot of loot. I was really happy to hear that. <laughs> What's this over here? Glowing red. Ah. The attention of the miners. This is a call for donations. The merchant. <clears throat> The mechanism of the old door that blocks access to the mines was damaged, probably by one of us. We asked to participate in the operation so we may buy the replacement parts that the merchant bought us for the mechanism and start working again. Alright, well, let's go see if we can help him out with that. Into the mine we go. Okay, lots of places to explore. Crafting table right there. Very nice. Making sure we don't miss anything here. <laughs> Whoa! Alright, that startled me. Those little burgers. There we go.
That's too bad. Can't go that way. Like I said, the bat creatures, those <laughs> startled me there. I was expecting something, but... That, uh, that got me that time. So many places to explore in this mine. Well, as rich as what they said that it was, I was expecting to see ore collecting spots very frequently on the walls. All right, let's see if we can find more of those bat creatures. There's something else that wants to drop in on us. Passageway. Huh. Well, let's take a look. off the box man they were talking about the riches and stuff I'd expect I'd be getting more than what I am really I was There you go, there's a purple one. At least we're getting some stuff here. See, that's what I was talking about, about when they said it was rich. I was expecting to see a whole bunch of these minor ones all over the place. Just like it is here. Just like this. That's what I was expecting. exactly what I was expecting.
Very careful, I'm going to tomahawk your ass. They're down here, so hopefully there's some goodies that they're guarding. Wow, Kurt with his armor and that new weapon. He's uh holding his own now. So is she. I'm glad to see that. We're getting somewhere. I mean we're nowhere to be jumping up and down and saying how great and glorious we are, but it's it's good to see some progress for once. Really glad to see it. A gate. We must find out how to open it. Right there with you, Kurt. like later on or maybe nothing don't know I want to see if we can find a lever or something around here for the gate I didn't know this was going to be turning into exploring the mine. Okay. Got to be a lever or something around here. Hum, hum, hum. That's right, you guys go run all around. I'm going to look down here for a lever. Okay, there's a climb point there. Huh. 
I don't know if we're going to get it down here or not because I see a climb point for a ladder there. I don't want to see a satchel. Ah, there it is. Cranks on the inside. So we'd have to do some more exploring in the mines. All right, that answered that question. <clears throat> Definitely have to do a little bit more, a lot more exploring in these mines. Nothing we couldn't handle for once. Yay, a dead end. Wait, it's firing on. All right, I won't complain though. I like my version better. Yay, a dead end. Okay, we got that. We got that over there. All right, looks like exit to the mine. Did I miss something? Yep. Well, we made it to the ruins. I think we're going to go ahead and wrap it up right here since we're getting ready to go to the ruins. And we'll see you guys next time.